What's good Planet Earth? Welcome back to the channel. My name's Charlie and thank you for being here. Today we're getting into a group that has been highly requested in the comments of my home free videos. This is Voice Play doing Nothing Else Matters by the incredible Metallica. Now if you've never heard them doing this song with the San Francisco Symphony Orchestra, was it Philharmonic Orchestra? I can't remember. But with some orchestra from San Francisco, go and watch it. Honestly, it's one of the best things ever. It's so good. But this is Voice Play, who are another a cappella group, as I understand it, doing this song featuring Jay Nunn. Don't know who that is. Let's get into it. Without further ado, let's go. You won't answer no calls. You'd rather be lurking. Yo. <laughs> So, bass, insane. That is Jeff Castellucci. This is my little list that I have here. As, as far as the research that I'm going to do goes, I thought it's always nice and respectful to have people's, people's names at least. I don't know anything about them and I quite like it that way. So, any information, put it down in the comments, guys. I know you're going to flood me with information, but that's how I like it. Because then I get to learn little bits that I wouldn't off the Wikipedia page or whatever. <coughs> People that have found out random bits of information here and there, either through actually interacting with them, going to see them, yada, yada, yada. It's much more interesting than me doing my own research. So let me know in the comments, guys. Also gives me an opportunity to converse with you guys and talk about it a bit. It's much more fun. Anyway, Jeff Castellucci. Insane. Did you hear that note? No, not yet. I think that was an E1. That's crazy. That's so low. What the hell? Now, if you're not listening to that on decent speakers or have never done, do, because I don't know what the hell just happened there. That noise can't have come from a human. Was that a bass note coupled with a Was that a bass note coupled with a bass drum noise that someone else made? Who's the drummer? Lane Stein. What is going on? So close, no matter how far. Couldn't be much more from the heart Forever trust in who we are And nothing else matters mm -hmm. Never opened myself this way Life is ours, we live it all Just say, ooh, and nothing else matters. Beautiful. So is he the is he the baritone? Is that who's baritone? See, no, is he the baritone or is he tenor? Who's who here? And also, who is Jay Nunn? Is he the guy in the middle? I don't know what's going on. Trust I seek and I find in you. 
day for us something new Open mind for a different view oh, oh, And nothing else matters Ooh, did you hear that? That was lovely. Uh, it all sucked out there. Oh, so they sucked everything out and then they put a little sort of muted, very midi sort of um, ooh in there. Nothing else matters. Never cared for what they do. Oh, it was hummed. It was hummed. That's why it sounded muted. I thought it would. They just EQ'd it in post. Sorry. Very open. Never cared for what they do. Never cared for what they know. Oh my god. Now I know this is I think this isn't a live recording, is it? It can't be. So there's gonna be some post here, but still. Still, the guy on the right is the drummer, so that is Lane Stein. Okay. So now we need to figure figure out who is who? Who's Mr. J Nunn? Who is Caesar De La Rosa and who is Eli? Jacobson or Jack Jacobson, Jacobson. Okay, three down. No, two down. Three to go. This is crazy. Much more from the heart, Beautiful, like this. And nothing else matters. And nothing else. Trust I see. Nice how they sort of bore that in chromatically. I don't just say. Yo, this is crazy. They are so good. The, the the arrangement is so inventive. I'm very critical of anyone that wants to cover this song in any any way, shape, or form because it is so good. But they have more than done it justice. Tip of the cap to you boys. So I think the guy in the middle is J Nunn. I might be completely wrong, but let me know. I think the guy in the middle is Mr. J Nunn. I think that's how you pronounce it anyway. I think the guy on the left of him is uh, Cesar De La Rosa. And I think the guy on the, the baritone, and I think the guy on the, to his right is Eli Jacobson, the tenor, I think. Never
that was intensely amazing. We're going to have to do that again. Go on with your bad self when you're fiddle playing as well. Mr. Lane. No, we missed it. Yes, drums. I'm speechless, moved, because I love, I love that S&M &S version of this song so much, and I, I find any other version, when it, when it drops like that, almost slightly disappointing, because that one is so full, and so, oh, so, yeah, it's just so full, I don't think there's a better way to put it, and they somehow... With <laughs> with five people and a fiddle, and admittedly some post-production trickery, obviously the drums continue after the drummers picked up the fiddle and whatever, but whatever, you know? It's still, it's still not a band and in a full orchestra. And somehow they've managed to put the parts together in such an intelligent way that you get some sense, and with the fiddle, which is just a stroke of genius, because that is the... That is the main feature in, in that S&M performance, is the strings. It is exquisite. It chokes me up talking about it. It's that beautiful. Honestly, you must go and see it if you haven't. It's, it's unbelievable. But that is the main feature in, in, in that version, is the strings. And they've managed to, to capture the fullness, the complexity, and the strings with that few people. That is insane. And, of course, he's playing the guitar solo. So not only have they captured the complexity, some of the string sound and that the fullness of that, that overall drop, which is incredible, They've also he's also playing the guitar solo. There are two birds with two serious birds with one stone there. Incredible. Welcome to the afterthought. What a absolute baptism of fire. What a first song to react to. Oh my God. I'd love to, again, I said this with um, 
home free, I would love to hear them do something live. I always judge artists and groups on how they perform live, so if anyone's got any suggestions for live performances for voice play, I would love, love to hear it and we'll check it out. But that was just insanely, insanely good, insanely beautiful, insanely clever in terms of the arrangement, amazingly executed, um, phenomenally mixed as well. But someone please let me know if I got the names right, that would be great, and if I didn't, someone please correct me. Now, if you're wondering why I'm wearing a massive coat inside, it's because I'm freezing, and I don't know why. My house is no colder than it normally is, but I am freezing. Maybe I've lost weight. Maybe that's just wishful thinking. Who knows, but that's why. But anyway, subscribe to my channel, the button's there. Like this video, the button's down there. Thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Um, if you want to support what I do, Patreon's down in the description. If you want to make a one-off donation for a request and ensure that it gets done, PayPal is down in the description as well. Go and follow my other socials as well. The links are also down there. You'll get different content there too. Anyway, have a great day. And as always, be kind to yourselves, love everybody, and take care. I freaking love you guys.